Hello, housemates, and welcome back to the Dorkest Estate over the Darkest Dungeon. Let's see. We are well on our way to doing various things. Uh, are these guys picked out for a reason? Yeah, they look nice and fresh. What was I doing? Hmm. I know I wasn't doing a veteran boss, that's for sure. Um, I need portraits, I remember that. It's been a few days since I... It's another antiquarian item. It's been a few days since I played. Um, so I'm getting myself a little bit reoriented, trying not to pull my microphone off of the desk here. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. So, we need portraits. Um, they are hard to come by. We could do that. We could do that. I think I'm pretty sure we decided upon this. That seems familiar to me. And now my party's gone away. Oh, that's because... Damn it. <laughs> that's because I selected a um, an apprentice mission and all those dudes were too good for it. Alright, let's put everyone back. Um... I feel like I had a plague doctor in there. No? Uh, damn it. I don't remember who else was in there. Veteran mission. I mean, it might have been Picvini. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm a bit lost. You got syphilis. That's not cool. Well, we could... We could do this. Um, you know, get some people towards level 4. That seems like a good idea. Okay, so this is an explore mission. Let's go back and see how everyone is equipped. We don't have a terribly large amount of money to spend. But, you know, you waste a lot of money if people die, is what, I'm, is what I'm thinking here. So, better to spend money to keep them alive. You know, it's just like, um, <clears throat> you know, things like internet service provision and basically any product. It's cheaper to maintain customers than to um, get new ones. So, better to put out a little bit of extra effort and expenditure to keep the people you already have. Okay. So with the composition of people, we have a little bit of slightly unreliable healing from the occultist, um, self-healing on the abomination, protection and dodginess, which can mitigate the need for healing on the, who should we call it, uh, man-at-arms. Okay, so we probably want this toxin trickery on you. You're in the third rank. There's not going to be a lot of movement. This works from the third rank. This works from the third rank. This works from the third rank. Okay. You're good. You're good. You're going to be in the back. Right, we have very little money. Uh, we're probably going to want to sell some trinkets. All right, we just got this one. We're going to keep it. Keep that. Um, I think I will sell this one. Okay. Um... Don't use this. <clears throat> We're about to get another one of these. Let's see if that leaves us with enough <clears throat> cash. All right. Um, 
do this. Okay, man at arms. Um, we need you to be good at protecting speed and damage. That's probably worth it. Um, oh wait, this is just better. Speed, damage, speed, damage. Yeah, this just totally dominates that item. Okay, um, we give him the other part of the box as well to give him hit points and dodge. Yeah, let's just give him the music. I keep wanting to put those two things together like a puzzle. I know that's not the way it works, but uh, I always think that. All right, Abomination, we have two locks for you. Speed, damage, minus HP. I think we've run that set before and it worked pretty well. I believe we have one item unique to you. Gives you dodge, accuracy to range skills. That's all very good. Let's, in addition, give you this book. <clears throat> For you, we have a couple of things. So this damage and stress damage. It's not really using a lot of damaging skills. We're using it more as a debuff. Um, this does give damage only versus Eldritch, so I might not want to use that. We could make his heal skills better. It's going to give him stress damage, quite a lot of it, but that I think that will... I mean, obviously, if he was going to do zero, you know, 30% of zero is still zero. So uh, it has um, a more unpredictable... It makes him swingier, actually, um, rather than more reliable, but uh, I think I'll give it a shot to see if it works. Okay. Let's make sure everyone has the skills that we want. He's got one damaging skill. He's got his healing skill and his debuff skills. So the healing and debuff, that's what these are good for. Maybe we should give him a stun skill in lieu of the weakness. We may want to go back and upgrade that skill. Spend a little bit more of our money, unfortunately. Okay, otherwise, we're not going to buy any camping skills. We don't have the, the money for that. Okay, you, <clears throat> you're in the front. So, yes. Hmm, now the question is Retribution is good, Rampart is good. I think that should work. With you, you always have everything. With you, we wanted all of that. Lots of range skills, which goes well with the, um, the trinket that we gave her. Okay. So now let's back up again for a second. Go to the guild. And improve your stun. All right, let's see if we need to sell more for the provisioning, to get the provisions right. Okay. <coughs> nope, we should be good. All right, so... Um, we have we have we a little bit of everything. Yeah. Okay. I think we should be good and fine and great. Let's get going. Beware the mark of death that fungal artillery can put on you. Sound went weird there for a second. It tells their fungal zombri brethren what to kill. Is my game like freezing or something here? I knew all these all right, paths whatever. once. Now they are 
as twisted as my own ambitions. Great. Okay. Explore 90% of rooms. This isn't the best setup for that. Um, so we're just going to start going straight down. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. True story. Okay. Not expecting to get a lot of loot from this. Aww. Lame sauce. Ambushed by foul invention. Okay. They're not surprised. Ooh, but we somehow managed to go first. Alright. This guy is probably going to go next, so let's stun him before he can. I don't know. We're a speedy group. Right, let's see. What do we want to do? Um... Yeah. Mm. Wow, we're really fast. I expected us to get... Are they Eldritch? Yes. I expected them to go first, at least the dog. Okay, good. The grave robber can cure herself of that. Ow! Unbalanced. Which is what she will do. Gross. Uh, should we heal? Yeah. Nice. Well, that's fine. I can deal with that. Super dodge. Alright, um... Let's... Four, you're not quite gonna die. Let's get rid of this dog. Okay, not quite gonna get rid of that either. Uh, come on. Aha! So hopefully he should now attack him. Yeah. Nice. Alright, you're blighted again. Um, but let's just use you to take care of these guys. How are you doing? You're not gonna die. Um... That surges as the enemy crumbles. Mm -hmm. Damn, I was hoping I'd kill that. Um, okay, that's fine. Nice. He's gonna die. Yeah. Okay, good, great. This momentum. Push on to the task's end. Nothing. Alright, got a scout. Got a super scout. No secret rooms, unfortunately. We did find an obstacle, which is always irritating. Uh don't remember these. I always forget how to deal with all these things. And then someone tells me in the comments and I still forget later. I could burn it. Burn it. No, didn't do anything. Um, we can douse it. There we go. Wait, second wind. Okay, it's like I can't see what you got. Stop talking. Nature herself. Well, we got a shovel from our loot, so net broke even there. Luggage. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Yeah. 
delicious. I wonder, I always wonder about, oh, here's a combat that's popped up, what their rations are exactly. Is it like dried meat, bread and cheese? I mean, because they eat some, they eat some rancid garbage uh, getting off those like food carts and bloated carcasses. They're obviously not too picky. No rabies. Right. Yeah. Continually onslaught. Destroy them all. Alright, let's Nice. I think Junio's head Junia's head is a good addition. Their formation Oops. is broken. Not actually what I meant to do. The offensive. But it'll work. Well, ah, lots of crits going on here. That's one way to manage the stress. Yeah, we get it. Okay, you can only use that in yourself, so... I want the uh, occultist to heal. What? <laughs> 32! Ridiculous. The reason why I said Junio's head, it's like, I keep thinking of those, um, the little forest spirits from Stardew Valley, the Junimos. That's what I have stuck in my head. So I sort of mix that up with Junia. No, just walk, dude. La la la. Alright, now back to actual exploring. We have a combat right in front of us. Let's torch it up a bit. No, spider. Yes, surprise. I'm gonna fucking die, spider. Yes. Automatic death. What? Dodge it. No, don't get stunned or diseased. Grave Rapper should be used at dealing with giant maggots. Yeah? Goodbye. Yes, you uncivilized maggots. Alright, that's interesting. As victories mount, so too will resistance. That'll be... Um, gold fodder, since we already have one of those rings. That is one that it might be useful to have duplicates of. God. I swept earlier today. Stupid housemates, cats, so much fur. Now I'm all sniffly. Not that I'm allergic to cats, it's just it's all filling the air now. Nice. Waiting to I would like expected. to get, you know, some portraits other than the three I'm going to get from completing the quest. Um, we could leave out that room, but let's see. Might as well go all the way. Aha. This is helpful. Eight food. We don't have anywhere to put it. Um... Drop that key. In the nick of time. 
They found that gross carcass food, and they're like, oh, yeah, we are hungry. Weirdos. I mean, I guess that's not that weird. I, uh, I really like that show, uh, the show version, the TV show version of Hannibal, and uh, sometimes that show would make me hungry, and, you know, that's probably really weird, too, that that happened. Man. Stop being hog face pig bodies. Save some for later. Aha! Paintings. Portraits. We need those. Journal page. Uh, right, let's get rid of those. Take the journal page. Uh, let's take the busts rather than the ring. In Radiance, may we find victory. All right, a good scout at this juncture. It's handy. All right, well, let's go this way. No. No, pour some water on it first. Okay. Ruins Adventure. All right, that's fine. I can deal with that. Scout! Yes! Secret room! Nice. Of course, now I don't have a key. We always... A handsome reward mm. for a task well performed. We're gonna come back to that secret room. It'll still be there. I think. Uh-oh. Aha! Okay, let's see... Um... Stung her. We don't like the stress. Uh, just. Oh, man. Lame. Ugh. Wasting our turn. Critical moose yell. Focusing him down. Can't have that. Oh, come on. Why is she so dodgy? She's old! Can't hit the broad side of an old woman. Yeah, I think the head is definitely a good investment, or a good take on the occultist. Been cursed. Double mark. That's not good. Gonna make himself a friend. At least the friend doesn't automatically get a turn. Uh, no. Uh, yes. Yeah. Die. Right. Hag. Uh, let's see. Um, we can soften him up or kill. Kill is good too. And then stun this one. Or just kill it. Ooh, a critical heal there. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's take this. Leave that. I'm planning on letting the torch go down. Uh, and then camping. I don't want to run into a... Come on, guys. They've been eating too much. Alright. I don't want to allow a whatchamacallit shambler to pop up, so I don't want it to be totally dark. No! No! Okay, good. God. 
a horde of spiders in the dark is like my worst, in this game is my worst nightmare. In real life, I don't really mind spiders. I let them live as long as they don't, like, interfere with, oh, come on, you suck. As long as they don't interfere with my, um, I don't know, food, basically. They can hang around and kill other things all they like. I'm quite happy for them to do so. We should only have to deal with one of the spiders this round. The others should die and one is stunned. One spider can't do too much damage. Green ones are nastier, and that one's already stunned. Nice. Is he gonna die? Yes. Uh, Slowly, gently, this is how a life is taken. Crunch. Give me a key. Damn. Success so clearly. All right. You. Maybe we'll get a key out or of this is it chest. Really a trick of the light. Nope. The hell. Eh. Uh, okay. All right, we'll go camp right before the. Um, Actually, no, we don't want to do that. We want to get the best loot we can from it, so we'll camp right after it. Okay, a trap, but not a combat showed up. Sadly, I won't have a key for the secret room, but it should still be good. Oh, they count as rooms to be... Does that mean that they're, they're, like, they're already uh, put into the map? beforehand. That's interesting. Huh. Alright, let's see what we can get. No keys. Glittering gold. I mean, it's a thousand. Paid for in blood. Um. Mm, no. Alright, so... Hopefully we don't eat. Oh, son of a... God damn it. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're not going to camp, and we're going to instead go and see if we can find more food to allow us to camp. So we're in pretty good shape. Why is everyone so suddenly stressed? God, these people have been eating so much. Are any of them stress eaters? Well, it's not that they're eating now. It's not that they're eating a lot. It's they're eating frequently. That's the problem. Wow. Uh, shit. So, guess we'll get rid of. We can just drink these. They might possibly be of some use. Okay, so we don't get too, too did up. Yes! That's what I like to see. Also good. <laughs> Crits. Everyone. Is he going to get to go? Nope. Oh, yes is the answer. <laughs> Not going to get to do anything useful, though. More crits. Jeez. 
getting we're gonna this is gonna be much more lucrative than I had anticipated. Um the light, the promise of safety. Still have a key. Of course it is. Well, that's why I had her pick it up. Get some scouting. Obstacle, that's fine. Alright, so we've got the rest of it mapped out here. Food? No. Um, I don't... There aren't any curios left. So we can drop... Drop this. Uh-oh. This could be bad. All right. You need to be stunned. Fine. Yeah, the stress is what I don't want. Aha! I haven't used his stun at all. Oh, that was stupid. I didn't pay attention to where it came from. My bad. The ground quakes. You got a big ugly dude, so do I. Nice. A singular strike. That thrown dagger is super good. We're gonna get hit by the big dude. seem to do anything, which is handy. Yeah! Snurf indeed. Um. Oh yeah. The head is definitely the right thing to bring with the occultist. seen that one before. Another sapphire, that's good. Right, let's ditch that for this, ditch that for this, ditch these for that, and then let's go home. There's nothing left to look at, so we're done. All right, that was more lucrative than I anticipated. We did get two other portraits, so we got a total of five. It's not a lot. We made about 17,000 gold. We got some trinkets that were interesting that I hadn't seen before. Got 
three out of four up to level four. Curious. Yeah. Means he's gonna read books. Clotter, it's not bad. Scurvy, he's got scurvy and syphilis. Got the runs and something else, probably rabies. Answered the letter. That I did. Now, like me, you are a part of this place. Great. Okay, so that went pretty well. Let's unequip all those so that they're all in our inventory. Uh, so we wanted portraits so that we can do this. We still need 20 more. But it takes so long to get portraits. All right, so uh, we got some nice cash. We're back up to more than we started with at the beginning of that mission, so that's definitely good. And we had spent a lot, so uh, yeah. All right, what do we want to do next time? Um, champion missions. Nice. Uh, let's see. Sunring. That could be interesting. Portraits, a gather three, which means that uh, our inventory would be not a problem at the beginning, but would become worse as it goes along. Hero's ring, a long veteran mission. That might be good to do just to get our reserves back up. We can get three more portraits, and we do need portraits, but this is a nice ring, and we could make a lot of cash on this, so I'm probably gonna do this one. Um, we'll take our antiquarian, of course. Antiquarian. What do you have? You have hysterical blindness, but it's not so bad. Um, you take an antiquarian. She also has hysterical blindness. You take also, um, Plague Doctor to deal with some disease stuff. We can't take any more diseased people because uh, the Plague Doctor can only do two diseases, one for herself and one for a companion. Um, we want to make sure not to put any of these people to five. That's something we have to keep in mind. We could take Peck off who could cure her own disease with a camp. She could have cured it last time, but we never got around to camping. I suppose I could have camped even with the low food. I, I should have done that. All right. Um, hmm. Take Venwa. So, I mean, we could do this. You have the runs. Mm. There are two camps in this. So there will be two chances to get rid of diseases. This is a... I mean, we can do a lot of damage with this build, but it also seems like, I don't know, might be kind of squishy. Uh, we're going to give it a shot. So this is the build, uh, the group that we'll go over next time. Hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. Uh, I know there's a little bit of a delay uh, in the schedule, but now we're back. Uh, so please hit thumbs up on this video and subscribe to continue watching my dungeon diving exploits. And if you're not going to do any of those things, then I hope you get a random disease from a maggot.